Yeah. Stay here. Like this is this doesn't even seem like a big deal. I'm going into an attic, and it's making it all intense. Oh man, can't climb up the stairs too quickly. It'll scare Kenny. Oh, uh, if Kenny's a zombie, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. If if at any point anything happens to Kenny, I'm literally screwed because he's my only bud bud. Kenny. Oh god. Kenny, are you a zombie? Kenny. Kenny. You okay, man? Dude, he is messed. He's just sitting. Look at him. Oh, I guess it's like still the same the day is that? as um. It's still the same day as like his whole family died. So, what? Ew. Ew. Nice boxer shorts. American Apparel? Kinda looks like Duck, don't he? Sure if it's Duck was a bigger, older, wore his underwear with no clothes and was different skin color. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. You need to man up, Kenny. You can do it. Before it was your own son. Now it's just a kid who needs your help. You can do this, Kenny. You need I feel like getting him to do it's better no. just because... Just... Oh, God. Just because, um... I don't know. He needs to man up. He can't keep being depressed. Here. This will make it clean and quick. I don't know that I can do it, Lee. I mean, if you can't do it, I'll do it. I know you can. I know that you can. I couldn't even help my own boy. That was your own flesh and blood. No father could have done that. But you can help this boy. Don't Why would he shoot boy. downwards? Send him on his way. When we're in a house, it could. Okay. I feel like that's the better option. Maybe not, though. <laughs> He's gonna shoot, and some guy on the bottom floor is gonna get shot. <laughs> the game, the game will freak out. Side note: How did Kenny keep his mustache so well trimmed throughout all of this? We should bury him. I'll take care of it. You want to make out with me? <laughs> All right, Kenny manned up. I'm I'm happy with Kenny. Well, that's kind of sad, I guess. Zombie kid. Now we're having a funeral. Just. Ew. <sighs> and to think, for a penny a day, we could have saved him. Oh, we are gonna bury him with the dog. I kind of said that sadistically as a joke, but <laughs> legit, he's going with the dog. Okay. Here, you can be with your puppy. Zombie dog and zombie boy hanging out together. Zombie dog and zombie boy. Love each other forever. Alright, man. Let's bury them up. They keep looking at them like they're gonna come alive. I mean, one of them's beheaded, one of them has a bullet in its brain. I sure hope they're not coming alive. Okay. Cover his face so you can stop looking at it. Ah, oh, I covered his chest. If you're being distracted by the boy's face, you have to bury it instantly. Ah, oh, Clementine. You wanna help? <laughs> you wanna shovel? <laughs> Clementine? Clementine? You wanna shovel? You wanna shovel? You wanna shovel? Okay. Come on. Hmm. 
Alright. Oh, the door opens outwards. It didn't initially, though. So, my point still stands. Okay. Is that his sock? Oh! What the hell? Hey! Hey! Oh my god. Who, Who are, are you? you? What the hell do you want from us? Oh, my whole body's tingling. What's going on? Oh man, Slenderman appeared out of nowhere. Someone was watching us. Someone standing there by the fence. Watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Yeah, the guy was being real stealthy. Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. Pretty sure it was a guy. Kenny? I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I mean, if I knew who he was, I'd probably say the guy's name. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. That's fine, we'll just sacrifice you. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. Alright, that's it. We stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. I mean, the guy's just gonna follow us. find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well then hell, what are we waiting for? I'll go get my stuff. No, Ben, you'll only slow us down. Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move it's Probably out. a good call, stay I mean... With Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Maybe. Uh... We, we need, need to focus, to focus on, on the boat. finding a boat right now, Clem. Like we talked about on the train, remember? Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my Every single one of those out. options disappointed Clementine, I think, so. I probably should have said you need to stay here and help. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Yeah. Yes? Where's the straight up yes answer? No offense, no offense Ben, but feel safer if you stayed here. How am I supposed to not take offense to that? What am I? A liability? Yes. Give me the option to say yes, goddammit! Great. Y E S. Why E Why E S confidence is earned, Ben. And you've got a long way to go to earn yours back after some of the stuff you pulled. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah, I feel you. Dude, bro is so pissed off. Yeah. Yeah, I feel you. Harvey Dent. I don't trust Ben at all. I, I don't even trust keeping him with everyone else. Then again, he's probably not smart enough to actually, like, kill anyone, but... Okay. Radioactive. It's a radioactive car. We're gonna die from radioactivity. Kind of unfortunate. Man, Kenny is, like, hardened, except he's not, because he wouldn't kill a kid or anything. He's kind of just moping. He's not hardened. Sixty-seven OB four X two O. You think they're safe at the house? You think everyone's safe back at the house? Safe as anyone can be these days, I guess. I just hate leaving Clementine alone. As if walkers weren't bad enough, now we got this crazy motherfucker on the radio stalking us. Yeah. It won't be a problem once we get out on the water. River's just a few blocks up ahead. Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. Yeah. Don't shoot, Kenny. Don't shoot, Kenny. What in the hell is going on? Are they helping us? Maybe they're trying to distract us. 
Maybe they're doing us a favor. I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. That sounds sexual. So, uh, just, just so you know. Hmm. Let's keep moving. That crawl is gonna see us. Oh, or not. So, I don't really think that's a favor, though, because... Somebody could have come out of like a hallway if they're just going like let's say let's say they're going to the left and we're on the way to the left. It's not really a favor because they can still see oh us. God. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. I don't think so. Kenny man, I don't think so. Maybe we need to come up with a new plan. This is the plan, Lee. This is our best and only shot. You said so yourself back at the house. You agreed with me. Yeah, but that was before we... I mean, let's just like, I'm sure we could make a paddle boat or something. I doubt it's that hard. Yeah, that boat's screwed, man. This one might still be salvageable. You better be right about this. Boats, f okay. I'm not gonna say anything. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. You know what telescopes what you do? Hmm? You wanna know what telescopes okay. do? Is you look into them and you get select vision and then a zombie comes behind you and kills you. That's what happens. I'm going to die, this game will end, series finished, GG, no replay, finished. Ew, dead people. Don't you normally have to pay money for these? Great, needs a quarter to work. Yeah. Hey, we have the quarter from, uh, what's-his-face? Oh, they're alive, ew. We still have the quarters from, um, Lily's dad from, like, the second episode. Oh, whatever. Solid. All right, so we need to go find a quarter. Hey, zombies, do you have any quarters? Ew. Fuck. Does this meant to be some kind of warning? Do something like this. Have you ever seen three hundred? Uh. That looks gross. Doesn't look realistic, but it looks gross. Alright. Look at markings. What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. Yeah, I don't know. What is that? Oh, it's nothing. Are we supposed to look at all the markings? Could be military tags, but what do they mean? 1x, 4x, maybe it's amount of survivors. I'm predicting it, man. Oh, it's a cash register. Okay, that's what I need. Hello, beautiful. Empty. Yeah, that would have been too easy. <sighs> okay. How hard is it to find a quarter? Like, guys, you should go exchange. Like, anyone watching this, go exchange all your money for, like, Miscellaneous change. Still intact. Gas siphon, tires removed, engine parts missing. Looks like this thing has been stripped clean. So I'm thinking we should bash this because there was always money in uh, in newspaper stands. Can we hit it? There we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, is there anything else further down? I just want to check. Must have been a hell of a wreck. Looking at the trolley. Having a good old time with the trolley. All right. We got a quarter, man. It's like the best thing that ever happened to us. Why would I shoot the walkers? It's like the worst idea possible. <laughs> what the hell? What? What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. 
Hull's crack beneath the water line, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? Yeah, I know. It's not exactly a good sight, Kenny. <laughs> what the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Alright. Keep a watch, Kenny. If we die, it's gonna be unfortunate. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. There's no way you could tell something's abandoned by looking into that. No way that one's salvageable. Why don't we go to like a boat shop or something? Can't imagine how many people tried to escape across it when the city started to fall. Nothing but water, not a boat to be seen. This is so messed up. But water, not a boat to be seen. I'm still nervous because I feel like something's gonna jump out at me because I hate looking through stuff like this. No sign of any boats down there. I mean, I'm gonna be honest, I kinda looked everywhere. Maybe I didn't. I mean, I've got cheats on, and I, I can't see cheats. I got, uh, recommended viewing on. Plenty of ducks, no boats. No way that one's salvageable. Alright, I get it. Nothing salvageable. Can I stop? Who is that? What the hell? Uh, can we keep watching? Get down. Get down. Why would you get down? You gotta keep watching where the person's going. Are you kidding me? Oh, God. It's just some person. We hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. He's getting some material to read. How about we go find out? Maybe it's just a scavenger. No, it's just a scavenger. Maybe he's just another scavenger like us. Yeah, and maybe he ain't. Maybe he's that fucker on the radio who's been messing with Clementine's head. Don't you want to know? Because I want to know. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I like how my option doesn't side, even matter. Cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, oh my god, this is terrible. How did how did Kenny get beside the, the the store? Are you kidding me right now? There's no way that would have happened. And then he got there without this person noticing. I guess there's a wall, but to be honest, it looks like a chick, not a guy. Just throwing that out there. Where did they go? Oh, get outplayed, bro! Get outplayed, bro! Okay, yeah, that's cool. I totally clicked it, by the way. That's a chick. And I'm dead. And I'm dead. Clementine, why are you here? Please, don't hurt him. Who is that? I'm so confused! You tear with my heartstrings, game. Alright, I made a call. Uh, you're not the guy on the radio. Have you been following you been us? Following us. Following you? Oh god, don't shoot her, please. Don't do it. Kenny, don't! He's with us! I said Kenny. Obviously he's with us. We just literally said his name. I think it's pretty clear that we know who he is. That gunshot really screwed us over, didn't it? Who the hell are you people? Uh, I asked you first. I asked you first. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. I'm not looking for any trouble. Oh, Clementine, such cutie. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? No. I'm from Macon. I'm from Macon. Kenny here's from Florida. She didn't ask for our life stories, Lee. 
What's the deal with this Crawford place? Are you sure you want to know? Not really, but hell yeah. When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive. Ew. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Oh man. Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. They kill kids. Who's been ringing those bells? Been ringing those bells all over town. Yeah, that would be me. I knew it. Why are you hey, trying to kill I knew us? The one who's been following us, fucking with us. Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa. <laughs> oh my God, straight your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy. Remember? Yeah. Well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the area as they cleared out. Geeks. That's that probably smart. Yeah, you know, like at the carnival, they'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart. The bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. <laughs> you just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. Um, was that you back at our fence? Is that you at our house this morning? Watching me through the back fence? Hell no. Believe it or not, I've got better things to do with my time. I mean, the guy at the fence seemed like he had a bigger build than that. Clem, what are you doing Clem, here? What the hell are you doing here? How'd you get out of the house? Well, Mead started getting really sick. Krista and Ben had to take him upstairs. I didn't just want to sit around there. I wanted to come help. I told you we didn't need any help. Dude, it's Clementine. She's really? awesome. Because if it weren't for her showing up when she did, I would have beaten your brains out. That's debatable. <laughs> uh -huh. 